these children of Eve that came into the big brother's house talking about Chinwe, Ruthie, and Dami, they are not playing about their job. I am sure that Biggie find them some chicken change, you know, you know, maybe one million or so to come and give Wahala to the housemates. Hmm. Anyway, I don't know why Cassia is still giving Kelly Ray her husband attitude. I thought they have settled. I thought everything is okay, but... I'm surprised that she's still giving one or two attitudes to Kelly Ray. I'm like, girl, Cassia, you need to calm down. Just less than two weeks to the game finishing and you're here just doing anyhow. But honestly, I understand where Cassia is coming from. In case you don't know why Cassia is walking past her husband, her, they will be discussing in group and Cassia will not talk to the husband, giving him one or two. Like, it's as though Cassia's brain, they touch. You understand? When she remember the disgrace and embarrassment, according to her, that Kelly Ray gave her last night, when she remember it, she will start giving Kelly Ray attitude. Even if they are in group and talking, she will stop, you know, contributing or laughing to Kelly Ray's joke and that kind of a thing. At a moment, she will talk to Kelly Ray. If she remember the embarrassment, she will off again. I really understand Cassia. You know why? Because no woman will be happy um, or feeling like, no woman will be happy feeling like her husband is trying to please other people to her detriment or to her disadvantage because that was what Cassia was saying that Kelly Ray is people's pleaser that why would Kelly Ray be pleasing the housemate over her like trying to please the housemate and embarrass her instead hmm. do you know well the fight was about meat pie according to Cassia Cassia you know kept meat pie for her friend in the house Victoria and um uh, one of the housemates now said that Cassia is hoarding meat pie or hiding meat pie. And Kelly Ray was like, Go and bring out that meat pie. Go and bring it out. Why are you hiding meat pie? You know, that kind of a thing. And Cassia was like, you didn't even ask me what, why I, I hid the, the meat pie. You didn't even ask anything. Just be, for you to be the good man in the house. Just for you to please them. You are telling me I should go and bring the meat pie that I kept for my friend. And you're saying it in an embarrassing way, in public, in, in front of every other housemate. Kelly Ray is telling Cassia that why she, why he is saying that is because it's better for him to embarrass her as the wife than for Ebuka to embarrass her in public. Kelly Ray reminded Cassia that um, he didn't even know that he gave Wani one meat, according to Wani. That's imagine Ebuka coming on Sunday to now ask him, why did you give Wani one meat? You know that to share with Sean that he doesn't want a situation whereby on Sunday, um, Ebuka will now ask Cassia, why are you hiding meat pie? You know, that kind of a thing as HOH and all those kind that it's better for him to embarrass the wife than for the wife to get embarrassed by Ebuka in national television. I don't know who you if you if Kelly Ray is making sense to you but Cassia is not having it at all like he's not having it Kelly Ray made food for her Kelly Ray went lay down on top of her and was begging her um she did not agree Kelly Ray changed the battery for her Kelly Ray did not Cassia did not even sleep on the same bed with Kelly Ray in the HAH condo like she was sleeping on the couch Kelly Ray could not sleep Kelly Ray came down to beg her to reason with her she refused to go up to sleep with Kelly Ray on the same bed. But you know what anger is? Anger, anger is very bad because as Kelly Ray is not sleeping, Cassia too, anger will not even agree, will allow her to even sleep. But whatever be the case, <laughs> I'm wishing them the very best. But that does not mean that Cassia is not defending Kelly Ray in his absence, even though she's angry. Because hey, in the kitchen, with um, all these three girls that came in, that came in, Cassia was still defending the husband. In fact, Cassia had a conversation with Tammy. I was like telling Tammy, I know that you guys are here. You guys have seen what we did, that we hid our marriage. I want to tell you why we did it. We just don't want to come here as husband and wife and people will be isolating us and will not enjoy the show. I want Kelly Ray to dance with other girl freely. I want to dance with other guys freely. I want to enjoy the show. We want to enjoy the show. That is why. Like, Dami was like, why are you explaining? Like, because Cassia wants, you know, first of all, ask Dami, do you know why we hid? And Dami said, no, tell me, why did you hide your marriage? <laughs>
<laughs> Dami was like, why are you explaining me? I did not ask, like, what's the problem? Are you scared? Like, I don't know if they are scared that these girls will reveal their secrets of their marriage secrets to the housemates before they do because um, Cassia was promising Dami that they are going to tell the housemates on Sunday that, in fact, she's going to tell Victoria first before they tell other housemates. Um, it's a whole lot of things because these three people, do you see what um, was her name? Ruthie, Ruthie, do you see what she, she did in the house? Like I've said that stealing other people's things in biggest house is not a crime it's not against the rule you can hide or steal other person's property and biggie will not interfere biggie will not say anything about it because why biggie wants basketballs biggie wants fight yes on past seasons we have seen housemates stealing coins stealing important things and biggie did not say anything about it anyway um ruti was saying that can you imagine that they have one wager back to back and this housemate is claiming that they don't have enough food for them? That how can they win three wagers in a row and they still don't have food? That they are saying that they shared the food in the house. So them that came into the house, what do the housemates expect them to eat? In fact, one of the housemates was telling Ruthie that the plantain she wants to fry is Wani's own. Wani is saying, I mean, Ruthie is saying, is that even one is so, so you're telling me it's one is own so that i'll be scared and not fry the plantain now that you told me it's one is own that is the one i will fry is that one is food that i want to even eat go 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 like hey these three people they have you know ganging up for fight in fact ruti have encouraged chingwe to mount a fight with nelly that she's going to join and finish her in fact what um ruti told um What's her name? Dami. You know, Dami is also a chef. Told Dami that anything she's cooking, that she should be adding things. If she wants to make um, fried plantain, she should add eggs. Anybody's egg, just take it. Like the housemates was asking them, where are you people bringing all this food that you people are eating? Because we shared the food among ourselves. Chingwe said, I brought it from Biggie's house. And Biggie's food that she doesn't know about them sharing the food stuff among themselves that she have to eat that they expect her to 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 do this thing to starve. She have already made the announcement that she's going to be searching everybody's locker, everybody's everywhere, anywhere she sees food, she's going to take and eat. But honestly, guys, I think that what this housemate supposed to do is that since they know that there is additional housemates in the house they're supposed to in that they are already shared food stuff among themselves they should bring one or two from each of the housemates and give ruti dami and chingwe because you know i don't understand where they're expecting the, the three girls to to starve if they now still now they will say that oh that they are looking for trouble they are looking for content i don't understand should they now starve so that they will satisfy you people that they are not looking for content. I think they should share the food with uh, the three girls that came in. That is the right thing to do. That is the humanity, showing humanity to the girls. Anyway, uh, let me know your opinion. The voting have ended yesterday. Well, and hopefully we'll see how the Sunday eviction is going to go. I enjoyed the, the party last night. <laughs>